Hey foodies, let's make some shrimp and snow peas. All right, guys. So this is just a simple marinade. It is soy sauce, some Chinese cooking wine, and some freshly ground black pepper. Just give that a whisk. And then we're going to be adding some shrimp. This is some jumbo shrimp and they're peeled and deveined. I did leave on a little bit of the tail for presentation. You can take it all off if you want to. Just toss that together, leave it in the fridge. All right, no salt needed guys. So we're gonna make a simple stir fry sauce, okay? This is gonna be some Chinese cooking wine, some soy sauce, some chicken broth, and a little sugar. We're gonna add some cornstarch as well. This is gonna help to thicken up that sauce. Just give it a vigorous whisk. Then some freshly ground black pepper. And then some rice vinegar, that's it. So place a pan or a wok over medium high heat with some canola oil or vegetable oil and then what we're gonna do is add the shrimp that was marinated. Cook the shrimp for one minute on each side. So that's about two minutes total. We don't need to overcook it. So once you've cooked the shrimp, guys, then you are going to just take it out of the pan. Okay, just set it aside. And then in the same pan, we're going to add some ginger and garlic. And just stir things around, all right? You'll see some brown bits. That's from the soy sauce caramelizing and all that. But just stir things around and then add the fresh snow peas. And then you're going to stir fry this for about a minute. Before you do add the snow peas, guys, you can add a teaspoon of oil if necessary. But if you have enough oil left over after the shrimp, then you don't need to add any oil. All right, so after about a minute, we're going to be adding that sauce mixture that we made earlier. Just stir that in. This is going to continue to cook the snow peas. So that's why you don't want to cook it for too long initially, because you want to maintain that beautiful green color. So add the liquid, keep stirring over medium heat, and just simmer that sauce for about two minutes. And then add the shrimp, and then complete the cooking of the shrimp. And this could be like 30 seconds to 60 seconds, because remember we cooked it initially, all right? For the snow peas, you just need three to four minutes total for it to be cooked. You want to maintain that nice crisp texture. And then I add some green onions and then I also add some sesame seeds in the end for garnish. And that's it, guys. You are done. Simple and delicious shrimp and snow peas stir fry. Amazing. Enjoy, guys.